Welcome to another Spreadsheeters video guide. You can find written instructions for these steps on the Spreadsheeters website. In this video, we'll see how to select multiple ranges in Excel. In Excel, a range is a contiguous set of cells. So these are cells that are adjacent to each other and I can refer to a range using the cell references. There may be a case where I need to select multiple ranges this could be to format them or maybe copy or move them uh, to a different location. There are three ways of doing this. The first is to use the mouse and the keyboard. So for this, I will select the first range, then hold down control key and select the next range and continue selecting the ranges I want all the while holding down the control key. So this is the first way. The second way is to use or enable the add or remove selection mode. For that, I press Shift F8, and if you can see here at the bottom of the screen, the Add or Remove Selection mode is enabled. In this mode, I can select the ranges, multiple ranges, without holding down the Shift key or the Control key. And when I want to exit this mode, I have pressed Shift F8 again, and that mode is uh, disabled. Now, the last way is to use the Go To option. So I can press Control G or I can, on the home menu, go to find and select and select go to. So this opens this box in which I can specify the ranges I want selected. I need to type in the cell references. So I'm going to say B4 to C4 as the first range and then put a comma and then say B6 to C6 uh, for the next range, another comma, and then say maybe uh, O8 uh, to Q8 as the third range. So of course the range for in the range I specify the starting cell and the ending cell and say OK. So now you can see that the ranges I've specified in go to have been selected. So while this may be a little more cumbersome way of selecting multiple ranges, it is useful when you have a very large set of data and it is not always possible to select the ranges using the mouse uh, and keep scrolling through the sheet. If you have the uh, cell references ready, you can select the ranges using this option. This is how to select multiple ranges in Excel. Please read the appended article for further guidance.